Are you looking for the best 3D printers? In this video we will look at some of the best 3D printers on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. Creality Ender 3S1 Pro. The Creality Ender 3S1 Pro provides good value in an open frame 3D printer, offering a large print area for its price. Although the S1 Pro comes in kit form, it's largely pressembled, so it should be easy enough for even a non techie to put together, and it produced quality prints in our testing. For software, you can use either Cura or the company's own Creality Slicer. The Ender 3S1 Pro works with a variety of filament types, including PLA, ABS, PET, PAR, wood composite, and TPU. Its printbed leveling process, which combines manual and automatic routines, proved slightly cumbersome, but it was easier than on other Creality printers we have reviewed. Setup instructions could be better, and the diagrams are cramped, but fortunately some third-party sites offer useful videos and other getting acquainted help. Number 2. NiCubic Vipper. The NiCubic Vipper, an open-frame budget 3D printer, provides a large volume print area and support for automatic bed leveling. It comes partially assembled, with the remaining steps, bolting the frame to the base, plugging several cables into their sockets, and attaching the filament spool holder to the frame, simple and straightforward. As for filament, the Vipper supports the standard ABS and PLA, plus TPU and PET. The printer only comes with a small starter coil, so you'll want to buy at least one spool at purchase. Pro tip, NiCubic and Amazon often offer bundled filament deals when buying a Vipper. Number 3. Ankamake M5. It's unusual for a new player in the 3D printer field to hit a home run in their first at-bat, but Anker has done exactly that. The Ankamake M5, an open-frame filament-based, FFF, model, is a cinch to assemble, and its print bed is easy to level, many 3D printers have died on that hill. It's easily the fastest FFF printer we've tested, and in our testing it consistently churned out high-quality prints with nary a misprint. A built-in camera can produce a time-lapse video of the print process or share data with an AI function to analyze a print in progress. It supports PLA, PET, TPU, and ABS filaments. Anchor provides a proprietary slicer for creating printable files, but claims compatibility with Simplify 3D and Prusa Slicer 2. Number 4. Dremel Digilab 3D45 3D Printer. Dremel is better known for its rotary power tools than its 3D printers, but the company put the same care and craftsmanship into the Digilab 3D45 that it has with its more traditional products. The 3D45 consistently produced good quality prints in our testing. A closed frame provides safety to users while prints are in progress. You can print from a computer over a USB, Ethernet, or Wi-Fi connection, as well as from a USB thumb drive. Every Dremel printer can connect via the web to the Dremel Print Cloud, from which you can prepare and launch print jobs, and even monitor prints in progress from an onboard 720p camera. Number 5. MakerBot Replicator Plus. The MakerBot Replicator and produced prints of good to excellent quality in our testing. It has a wide range of connectivity choices, you can print from a computer over USB, Ethernet, or Wi-Fi, as well as over Wi-Fi from a phone or tablet with the MakerBot mobile app installed. You can also print files from a USB thumb drive. MakerBot provides its own software, which can be tailored to a user's experience level. Although the replicator and is an open-frame printer, the extruder nozzle is placed in back of the extruder assembly and is hard to reach, minimizing the risk of a user being accidentally burned by touching the hot nozzle. Number 6. Ultimaker S5. The Ultimaker S5 costs a pretty penny, but you get a lot for its premium price. A 3D printer geared to professionals, the S5 has a large build area for a closed-frame printer and packs dual extruders, letting you print with two filament colors or types. To that end, it comes with one spool of tough PLA, polylactic acid, and one of polyvinyl alcohol, PVA, the latter a water-soluble filament commonly used as a temporary support material during printing for complex objects. Moreover, it is easy to set up and operate. 
The S5 can connect to a PC via Wi-Fi or Ethernet, and you can print objects from a USB thumb drive inserted into its forward-facing port. It uses the familiar Cura open-source printing software that Ultimaker now manages.